Hi guys, and welcome to today's video. Today we are going to take a close look at the Siberian Husky breed. Before we go on, don't forget to like and share if you really enjoy our content. Please hit the subscribe button to get notified when we post more dog-related content. Also, if you're struggling to train your dog or are thinking about getting a puppy, then affordable online professional training is what we suggest. See the link in the description and the pinned comment for more info. Siberian Husky The Siberian Husky originated as a sled dog for the Chushi tribe of eastern Siberia, in northern Russia. Husky was first exported to Alaska and Canada in 1908 to be used as sled dogs. Husky dominated native breeds in the 400-mile, all-Alaska sweepstakes race from Nome to Candle in 1910. In 1925, Leonid Sepala used a Husky team to make an urgent delivery of diphtheria serum to Nome, saving thousands of lives. This delivery became known as the Great Race of Mercy. In 1930, Russia allowed the last group of Siberian Huskies to be exported from Siberia. The Siberian Husky was recognized as a breed by the AKC in 1930. Most Huskies today descend from the 1930 exports and Leonid Sepala's team. Today Husky is one of the most popular northern breeds, serving as a pet, sled racing dog, and show dog. Let's start with the pros. Huskies are really friendly pets. They get on well with other dogs and children. They aren't likely to show guarding tendencies to strangers. If you're an active family, they'll be a great fit. Athletic and agile and loves the great outdoors, especially in cold weather. Now, let's take a look at the some cons. Massive destructiveness and howling when bored, left alone too much. They also have high grooming requirements. Huskies are loud breeds that like to talk to their families. Huskies aren't suitable for homes with other small pets. Vigorous exercise requirements. Escape artist and strong prey drive. Interesting facts, during World War II, many Huskies served in the U.S. Army's search and rescue teams, further capturing the public's admiration. In 1925, a statue of Bolto, the lead dog who finished the serum run, was erected in New York City's Central Park. Huskies sometimes have one blue eye and one brown eye, this is referred to as heterochromia. Huskies are fast runners and they can go upwards of 28 miles per hour. These adorable pooches are born with no teeth, and they can neither see nor hear. By four weeks old, your husky will be able to see and make some vocalizations. Appearance Husky has a double coat that is thicker than most other dog breeds. Dense undercoat and a longer top coat of short, straight guard hairs. Available colors include agouti and white, black and white, gray and white, red and white, sable and white, and white. Pure white is the rarest coat color of huskies. The color of a husky's nose depends on the color of its coat. Husky has many different eye colors include ice blue, deep blue, green, gray, brown, light brown, or amber. The male husky stands at 21 to 23.5 inches, while the female is slightly smaller at 20 to 22 inches. Both dogs weigh between 35 to 60 pounds and average litter size is 4 to 8 puppies. Huskies have a decent lifespan of about 12 to 14 years. Grooming. Huskies have moderate grooming requirements. Their coat should be brushed at least once every week to avoid any matting issues. Bath once a month is more than enough for these canines to remain neat and clean. Nails should be trimmed two to three times a month and ears must be cleaned frequently to avoid any ear infections. Their teeth should be cleaned on two to three times a week to maintain proper dental hygiene. Shedding. Huskies are seasonal shedders and mostly shed their fur quite heavily when shedding season comes. Huskies molt all year round, but excessively shed twice a year in spring and autumn. Lots of excess hair will be spread around your house, however careful you are. A good vacuum cleaner specifically designed with pet hair removal in mind is vital. During this period, brushing their coats with a metal comb on a regular basis is highly suggested. Huskies are not considered hypoallergenic canines. Food. Huskies are not notorious picky eaters, you will need to give careful to their dietary needs. 
High cereal or carbohydrate content in kibble is not recommended for Siberian huskies. Raw food diet with a generous quantity of fish would suit most huskies best. Husky pups generally eat more frequently than fully grown ones. Don't feed this canine any grapes or raisins and it's poisonous for dogs. Cost, on average a husky puppy will cost $650 in the USA and most puppies can be found between $400 and $1,200. The average price of a husky puppy in India is around 45,000 to 65,000 rupees. Price can vary depending on gender, pet quality, size, breeding lineage, color and markings, coat type, location etc. Exercise and trainability, Huskies need 30 to 60 minutes of exercise daily to keep them from boredom. Long walks or jogging sessions are extremely necessary for the Huskies. Huskies like to listen to their owner's commands but slightly stubborn and independent personality which can make their training sessions highly arduous for the owners. Only knowledgeable owner can efficiently control and handle such canines. Trainability of Husky is highly dependent on the experience and methods of their owners, trainers. Huskies are fairly intelligent canines and have awesome thinking and decision-making skills. According to The Intelligence of Dogs by Stanley Koren, Siberian Husky is ranked 45. They understanding of new commands 25 to 40 repetitions and obey first command 50% of the time or better. Huskies like to swim in a shallow pool, but mostly these canines are not keen on the water. They like to play in the water, especially in the summers, but most huskies are not that great. Barking, huskies have a habit of expressing themselves through their barking. They are known to use their voice several times when they need something from their owners. They give you a variety of vocal soundings including yelps, howls, and sounds like talking. If you want a calm, peaceful, and quiet breed, then a husky might not for you. Weather and climate. Huskies were bred to live in extremely cold areas and highly tolerant of cold and low temperatures. They can comfortably reside in snowy and wintry regions of the world. Best breeds to own if you live in a chilly area. Huskies have a decent tolerance to heat and can live in moderately hot areas. If you reside in an extremely hot area, then a husky might not be a very suitable breed for you. Friendliness, Husky is a great breed for small kids and happy to play loads of games with them. They remain kind and careful whenever they are around a small child. That's why Huskies are considered to be a highly kid-friendly breed. They are known to remain highly friendly and affectionate with other canines. They love to meet new pooches and make new friends. Husky have awesome canine social skills and perfect to raise more than pooch as their pet at the same time. Huskies are not generally seen to be a cat-friendly breed. These dogs are known to chase smaller household pets or animals such as cats. It is not an ideal pooch for who already got a small pet or a cat in their homes. But with proper training and early socialization, huskies can become kind and gentle with cats as well. Huskies are highly cordial and warm with the strangers. They do take a little bit of time to get comfortable with someone new. But once they start trusting the new person, they are known to be fairly kind and friendly with them. Early socialization is very important for huskies to become more sociable and friendly in nature. Adaptability. Huskies are not highly recommended for small houses and apartments. These pooches have high exercise requirements and also very active inside their homes, so they require a big space. If all their exercise needs are fulfilled on a regular basis, they can be somewhat adaptable to apartment lifestyle. Huskies have a lot of exercise and maintenance requirements which can overwhelm for a first-time owners. They are a bit independent-minded canine who require the guidance of a well-experienced owner so that they can become more obedient and well-mannered. These pooches are not considered to be a very good option for first-time owners. Huskies are company-loving canines and cannot live without the presence of their loved ones. They can suffer from separation anxiety, if they left alone in the house for long periods of time. This could lead to destructive behavior like excessive barking, furniture chewing etc. Guard dog, Siberian Huskies are not known for their guarding abilities. 
These pooches don't have great protective instincts and it's not in their nature to be aggressive with other people. As a result, they aren't thought to be good guard dogs. Drooling. Huskies do not drool excessively. These pooches mostly drool when they have their meal or they want something delicious from their owners. Aside from that, these canines don't dribble too much. Health issues. Huskies are relatively healthy dogs when compared to some other breeds. But still, they can suffer from various health issues are as follows. Eye problems 10% of them being affected in some way. Uvia dermatologic syndrome. Symptoms include red painful eyes, skin pigmentation and whitening of the hair. Cataracts. Thought to affect 10% of the breed. Progressive retinal atrophy. Hip dysplasia. Hearing problems. Deafness can be a factor for husky owners. Skin problems, with two main culprits, follicular dysplasia and the results of zinc deficiency. Have you had any experience with Siberian Husky? We'd love to hear your story in the comments below. Thanks for watching this video and we will see you in the next one.